You have to hand it to him. Can you believe it? Just a wee bit. Good boy. Hi guys, Todd here. Uh, we have me. We have coffee. And we have ginger nuts. And we have a dog. Because everybody wants to see TJ. Probably be better if I just moved out the way. Um, but, right, it's vlog time. Um, ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Now, it's been a very quiet week. Very quiet week. Uh, it's been great uh, because I've been able to get so much other stuff done. Uh, and not that I don't like doing reviews and stuff like that. It's just sometimes it kind of takes over my life and talking to people and emails and all that kind of stuff. So it's... Uh, Anyway, uh, before we get going, uh, we have things I have to do, uh, things I have to say. Biggest, biggest shout out ever uh, to Gary's old man, Ken. Ken, congratulations, sir, on beating the big nasty C. I stoked for you. I mean, Gary's been keeping me. Gary's from, Gary runs Kernel Vapes, and his dad, uh, Ken, uh, he's been fighting cancer, and he's got the letter, and he's got the two thumbs up, and he's beating it. And um, so chuffed for you. So chuffed for you. Uh, well, Gary's been a total nerve. Uh, been out of it, but uh, he's just. Talking to him there, and he was so happy. And I'm dead happy for you, sir. So congratulations on that. Great news. I uh, can't really beat that. Can't really say anything else after that. Everything else just seems so insignificant. Um. Anyway. Um. Oh. <laughs> we had dog of the week last week. Uh. This week we will have cat of the week. This is cat of the week. This cat. Uh, and in fact, I've forgotten the cat's name. Uh, this cat was sent on to me by Just Poo. Uh, this is Ginger Poo. Uh, we shall call this cat Ginger Poo. And uh, the photos were sent on, and uh, I said I'd put them there. One of them's kind of uh, racy, but uh, we'll leave it at that. Uh, speaking of Just Poo, Just Poo's a guy. Uh, he does. He, it's not done so many recently, but he uh, used to do a lot of rebuild videos for the Rose Atomizer. Uh, it does crack and rebuild uh, videos better than the ones I do. Uh, so uh, there's a guy called Polly Meatballs as well. Uh, if you go, if you ever go to my website, uh, my my blog, uh, I do post up uh, written reviews by Paul Polly Meatballs, and I do when uh, just poo is going to post up his videos, I'll post them up there as well. Because uh, I think they're too good to just limit them to... I, it helps them out and it helps you guys out because you get to see more uh, talented people than me doing stuff. Uh, not that you can't do that already, there's a lot more talented people than me out there, but uh, it's just a little bit of extra help for folk, which I think is good. And it helps these guys get awareness for them. Um, so, cat of the week, uh, Ken, what else have we got? You do, oh, oscilloscope, I couldn't get it to work, I had no idea why it wasn't working, and I've been watching videos on YouTube and, and reading the manual and trying to teach myself how to use it, and, uh, and, and, and it turns out that the, the, the earth, wire on it was snapped inside so uh, that's why I couldn't get it to work so a uh, couple of probes just arrived uh, this morning I <laughs> didn't have an anal probe uh, just arrived so I've been tinkering with that and I'm getting there and that leads on to a fine chap called Martin uh, who I've been talking to and he's going to try and sort me out something for doing 
that an inline meter that I can connect the oscilloscope up to and and so I'm getting there eventually uh, eventually uh, what else have we got mm, coffee right oh my forum uh, my forum I've changed, I've pretty much made it all public, you can't post on it but rather than folk joining up, not liking it and leaving and me deleting accounts, um, I've just, 60% of it's open to the public so you can go and read and see if there's anything there that will help you uh, and if you like what you see then you can join up, it's entirely up to you, um, But so that's that. Uh, now vaping gear, vaping gear, this week I will put the video for the Jolly Box. Uh, I'll make that live as I'm editing this video. Uh, it's in the house just now. Uh, you'll you'll see the video yourself. It's a beautiful, beautiful box mod, a wooden box mod. It's a very old chipset. I mean, it's a chipset that's been used for quite some time. And uh, as I say in the review, you have to adjust the way you vape. You know, you, you need to use standard resistance atomizers. You know, you, you're two ohms and above. There's none of this sub-ohm vaping. So you have to bear that in mind. Um, however, you then have this on the opposite side, <laughs> the axis. Uh, I put up on uh, Facebook a sneaky little peek at uh, this thing and I keep getting e-liquid all over it. Uh, this thing is 68 watts. 68 watts it's, it's capable of pumping out. I just It's on uh, Schmoe Vapes. Schmoe Vapes uh, are going to be selling it. And there'll be other resellers across the globe, but your Schmofapes are in the UK. Um, yeah, Axis Box Mod by AM Productions. Uh, Anti Meridium, I think it is. I don't know. Uh, AM. We'll call them AM. Uh, 76.8 watts. <laughs> That's just seriously crazy. Um, it really is. Um, yeah, you've got a, a, a readout here. Um, there's no voltage drop at all. Uh, that I mean, I had a... Where is it? Where did I put it? It's in the house. Arse. Uh, I did a, a, a 0 0.6 ohm build on something, and I can't remember what it was now, uh, is it here, um, bugger bugger bugger, I'll check the resistance on this, right, this is 0.6, this is the, the, the nitro, uh, which is becoming one of my most frequently used uh, atties at the moment. Uh, I really love the vape from it. Right, I actually have to turn this down to about three volts to get, well I actually have to turn it down more than that. If I put it to four, four volts I'm getting like uh, 20 watts out of it, which is so much, it's too much for me. Uh, the power in this thing is incredible. It's a twin 18650. And uh, so that's me, I'm down at 2.77 volts. Two point seven volts. If I turn it up. It just blows your freaking mind. Um, I'll put it halfway. Three point. That's three point three seven. It's not halfway. No, just about. Yeah, 
mental. It's absolutely brilliant. And and it's been, I actually ended up going to my bed early last night because um, I had, I'd overdone it. <laughs> Just totally overdone it. I keep saying this, I need to get zero milligram or four milligram, something six milligram nicotine. Uh, e-liquid for doing these kind of builds because I can't, it's just incredible. Uh, can we go, this is four volts, do a direct, length, a direct lung inhale. It's a pistol grip. Just... It's just mental, just absolutely mental. And just to show you, I mean, that's where I'm, that's it, almost as low as it'll go when the, where the wee white dot is. And I'm still vaping it at about 15 watts there. Oh, my head's going already. Hey, oh, oh. But uh, what I will do, I'll show you something else that just arrived today. The Hermes V2 from the Holy Land. Um, this was sent on to me by Yuri. Um, the website is uh, holylandmods.com, which is under construction, but uh, they're also in Vaporwall and israelvapors.com. Um, so that's this little dripper here. Uh, I'll, I'm going to pump this up. It's a uh, tri-post, uh, two air holes coming from underneath, so the airflow is coming underneath the coils again. Um, it is, it's nice. Uh, great vape from it. Beautiful flavour. Stunning flavour. Uh, I'm looking forward to doing the review on this one. Um, it's... I'll get it on a mech mod uh, for because it'll look better than on this. Not that this doesn't look good, but uh, just for aesthetics, it'll look better. And this drip tip came with them as well. Oh, wow, wow. Uh, so that's that. The... The V3 Flip is winging its way here as we speak, um, so looking forward to that. Um, I got some, uh, what else did I get? I've just paid for a Chi Yu, thanks to Colin for selling it to me, by the way. Uh, cheers, Nibs. Uh, his Nibs. Uh, Google Drive. Upcoming reviews. Uh, the reason that I'm getting a Chi Yu is... There's a, a lad, uh, he's on Anatolian Mods forum, anatolianmods.com, and he's got a, a Nef hyphen I switch and top cap, 21 by 1 threading. Uh, I'll, if I remember, I'll get a photo in here as well to show you. Um, he's going to be making these, so it kind of makes your chi you into. It gets rid of the, the knurling and the lock cap and it gives you a recessed button and more of a streamlined look to the mod, which I quite like the look of. Um, the Fuse XL3, the, I got in touch with the guys and they are still going to be sending that on. Um, it's an entirely waterproof mod, uh, totally waterproof. Uh, I'll take that jolly box off that list just now because I'm going to be putting the review up any second. Um, I don't know if I said this in the last review. I don't know if I said this in the last blog, but uh, Rand's Steampunk Vapors Piston Mod is coming along for a review. Uh, this is courtesy of deliciousmonster.com. Uh, this thing is just, I'll try and get a photo in here as well. This is just bonkers. Proper steampunk. Proper steampunk. Very uh, excited about that one. Um, 
We've also got the Stingray Red Copper Limited Edition coming. There's only going to be a thousand of these made. Um, so Drew's sending one of them on. Um, and everything else I think you know about or I've mentioned. Yes. I got the, my batteries for the the Vapor Giant that's coming. You know, big 26650. Uh, my uh, batteries arrived for that. And I'm absolutely in awe at the size of these friggin' batteries. Look at them. They're monsters. Absolute monsters. Um, little ego setup that I've been vaping away on. Look at the size of that. It's huge. Um, so, that's coming. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Right. I'm going to pause a minute and I'm going to eat a biscuit and uh, you may, might not want to watch this because I dip biscuits. I'm not doing anything quite so cultured as drinking beer, burping and farting, uh, Mr. Green, but uh, I will eat my biscuits. Mm. I did get... What did I get? What did I get? I'm losing it. Um, E-Fest purple batteries. I got a couple of them again, uh, just to go in this. Um, so, got a couple of batteries. What else have I been buying? What else have I been doing? Oh, did you see? Uh, oh, where is it now? At Mama Canny, uh, are they've cut? They're coming out with a dripper for the the Nemi Nemesis. You know the 14500 651 well it's a, a dripper but it you know it'll fit in hybrid mode as well looks dead cool um so they're coming out if i can find a picture or a video i'll, I'll put it up here as well um there's a brass or a copper 49 mod coming to schmo vapes soon um just look at my facebook page and see what oh the key that i polished my 49 and I polished the cage up. Looks stunning. Um, cage looks really nice. Did a review for the the TNS, which is that's bloody good at it. Um, it's a strange looking beast. It looks. I'm just looking at the photo that I did for it. It looks absolutely stunning on the Poldiac. It looks absolutely stunning. Uh, it's it's up there with the the nitro, you know the vape, the nitro and the the TNS. Different ones got juice coming from below, ones got juice coming from above, but they're both running them dual coil, quite a similar type of vape. Um, we've done you that. We've done you that. We've done you that. What does that mean? Uh, oh, you leak. Uh, of course, I did the review for the Elite Dripper. Beautiful little dripper. Uh, he's actually got a couple of other little things in mind for that. It's pretty much going to turn the Elite Dripper into a spheroid type device. Uh, he's also making another hundred of these drippers. Um, he only did 50 originally, but he's going to do a hundred more. Uh, what I never said in the review is that uh, he also includes a hundred mils of juice with every more every dripper that you buy. Uh, nom, 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 nom. Um, and I think that's about it. Of course there was the raffle. Um, we did the raffle. Did I, did I see how much uh, you guys raised? I can't remember if I did or not now. Oh, I'll tell you what I did get. I got the... Um, had a hell of a hassle getting the Wi-Fi signal out here in the shed. It was doing my head in. Um, so I ended up going and buying these power block, uh, TP-Link power block adapters. You know, they carry the your network signal through your mains, uh, 500 megabyte ones. 
uh, are just fantastic, really are. Um, <laughs> that just sucks. I'm saying they're absolutely fantastic, and the signal the signal has just dropped. You ass. Um, oh, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Right. Uh, for February, total including, including gift aid was £2,452 that went to Macmillan. Uh, so thank you to everybody. Uh, so you guys raised in two months 6,622 quid. Thank you very much on behalf of the charities that the money went to. Um, like I said, I'm going to leave it a couple of months before I do another one. Um, I don't think that it's fine. Uh, what else? Oh, I did. Uh, if you go along to my website, uh, toddreviews.com, uh, I've put up a link to, in the top right corner, the European Free Vaping Initiative. Uh, if you click on the, the logo, it'll take you along to the EFVI page. And uh, you can go along and you can click on it and you can go to the online system and, and sign there. Uh, I'm not going to go into a great detail about what it's all about. Uh, I would suggest you just click on the logo and go to the web page. Uh, if you want, uh, if you're at all concerned about, uh, you know, what's happening with vaping in Europe just now and... Uh, I, I strongly suggest you just go along to that page, read it, read it carefully, and then go and sign up. Um, it, it just doesn't even make sense, this whole fucking... I can still go and buy a packet of fags and not get into trouble and nobody will bat an eyelid at me, but, you know, can I go vaping? No. Um, anyway... I think we're just about done here. That's 24 minutes. I'll probably edit some of this out because I was talking shit for too long. We'll have another vape. There's an email from, uh, is it Brantley? Brantley Masters. He's just picked up an atomic for his guppy. He sent me a picture. He's a happy lad. That actually looks quite smart. Atomic on the guppy. Nice one. Glad you like it, mate. Uh, glad you like it. And thanks for sending me an email. Uh, right. I am now going to go and put up the video for the Jolly Box. So you'll be able to watch that. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, any questions regarding any videos, you know, go along to my Facebook page. Um comment on there, you can go along to my blog and comment on there, uh, don't email me via YouTube because I've, I don't really check the comments on there at all, uh, some people send me private messages through YouTube, uh, also on Facebook, uh, I now have a Facebook page, so anybody can go along and comment on there, it's open publicly, uh, and, and that's that, enough of the, that stuff. Um, Right, just bought. He, he wasn't well yesterday. Uh, he was a wee bit sicky. In fact, both ends, my biscuits, both ends were going. Uh, so he's a wee bit of a hang dog today. Yeah, haven't you, pal? Yeah, you know so well. You want to go for a walk? Go for a walk. Toast and tea. I always get some. Uh, uh, right. Uh, thank you to everybody for watching. And uh, we shall catch up with you soon. Uh, ah, that's it. I'm away. Adios.